welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me yet again. Uh, we have a box number four. Uh, if you've watched the previous videos, I have six of those and this is box number four. So let's have a look without further ado. <sighs> um, if you've been watching, I have been promised out of those six boxes, one box to be a premium box. Uh, it costed a little bit more money and that looks like it could be it. Um, the last, the first two were a bit of a disappointment. The number three was quite okay. This one looks even better on the surface anyway. So let's start with that. I see you have quite a few of the Clinique bits, right? So I know you might say oh, it's great, it costs a lot of money. Um, the Clinique doesn't unfortunately warrant a price anymore on eBay, uh, not anywhere near the retail price because of the amount of fakes is out there. Um, I'll have to just double check and make sure it's all um, meant to be sort of legit and kosher. So I just have to double check just for my own peace of mind. But I see we have a few of the Clinique things here. As I said, unfortunately, because of the eBay and a lot of fakes, something that Clinique and Ita would be like £50 retail, you're probably lucky to get £20-25 pounds on eBay. So nonetheless, I'm not overly excited about that. However, it's still a money and we need to get some back. So that one is a little one so sorry we're probably talking about i don't know 18 pounds 20 quid and 15 for the little ones okay we'll have another another one yeah anyway 15 pounds and i see we have a lot of lumen they're the um skincare i think a lot of them are for men um, on Amazon, those guys are going for, again, double the amount what they are on eBay. I think you can have a set of three if we got all the, um, I think that could be it. Something like this set there on Amazon, I think it's about 60 quid on eBay. I'd be looking about 30. Nonetheless, um, I'm not sure whether they're allowed to sell this on Amazon or not. So we'll have to have a look. But nonetheless, it looks like we'll have a few. So let's get them all out. In the end of the day, if I've got enough of them to make bundles on eBay for 30 quid, so be it. So we'll have like a cream, face cream, duck circle cream and like a exfoliating rub. It's tiny, how cute. Right, there's a few of those guys out. Oh, sorry, I'm so not comfortable being on the floor, but I don't know how else to do it. Okay, right, so we have more Clinique. Oh, I love this one. If any of you girls ever used it or haven't used it, uh, this is very dry to combination skin. I love this. This is so good. Um, no, no way, I'm not advertising cleaning, but you know, just telling you what I use. Uh, we've got foaming cleanser. See that to me, right? Automatically, I'm picking up this one. To me, that does not look legit. Um, if you look at the Clinique thing, it is not actually in the center of the bottle. So I'm not being funny, but generally, if I pay like in the shop, like £30 for a an item, I do expect Clinique to actually centralize the letter C in the middle, so hmm. a bit skeptical now. So we have Curl Booster Cream. Okay, looks like, yeah, Curl Booster Cream hair thing. Tears 2025, so date's okay. Don't know the brand, we're gonna have a look, but it looks like it should be worthy. We have Origins again, 15 quid. 15 to 19 pound. Okay, we've got Elemis. Seem to be getting those. They are, I think, 24 or 22.99. That's fine. I've got some more of those Lumen stuff. There is quite a lot of them actually is on eBay, so I don't know. I think it's a fairly new brand, but it seems to be quite popular. Of course, we have some Chinese special. I think some makeup brushes, of course. <laughs> Lollipop sticks, no. <laughs> I think they're the wax things for legs or face for some people. Uh, we have, oh, what do we have? What do we have? Oh, mystery box. Okay. Brighten up your today. Oh. Hair bleach. Okay, well, that's a very nice kit for hair bleaching, wouldn't you say? Highlights. Okay, well, it's still probably worth something. I don't know how much though. Uh, we have. Number seven, capsules, they're not a lot. They're, I think, about £11 for 30. Uh, Elemis facial oil, 16 99 for a little one. Surprising, it looks really cute, really bright, but you think it'd be worth more, but no. Fortunately not. 
another origins this well yeah scrub cleanser we have some kerastas again that probably be 15 quid but missing the lid so hopefully we'll have a lid somewhere down there we have okay the beautifying oil again 15 or 18 quid and again it's a good make well it certainly is a better box i must say <laughs> enemies collagen cleansing balm again i'll have to just double check to make sure but yes that looks okay uh sorry the size is what 100 grams i think oh 25 pounds 29 pounds something like that let's see we have some grey reducing shampoo for men they actually work really well you're like wash your hair and your grey hair like get covered up gently by that kind of thing and every time you use it it gets darker and darker it works really well for men again not advertising but it's actually really good so uh, we have pixie that was tenor we had one in every box i think so far uh, okay and yes we have this one as we know that's uh yeah gsp exit product mm. um 20 quid anyway on the personal account we have i can see we've got a few of the ordinary stuff again again if you remember they're about 8.99 to 10.99 depending what it is the box is nice and tidy makes a change normally they're squashed to billy buggery uh we have oh drunken elephant okay uh c firma day serum i think if you buy this in shop it's about like 90 quid or something um on ebay we are looking about 60. this one is date is september 2021 so not long left so still 50 quid somebody can make a good use for that uh we have release oh skin tonic okay i think they are about 15 pounds might get away with this on amazon i don't think it's scratch some more the lumen stuff a bit dodgy but yeah some of those little creams we have what do we have Ooh, different shampoo peace love hair Woo! <laughs> it says that it actually says that since when the peas got something to do with hair anyway um it looks nice it's probably worth it's recycled it's vegan friendly it's blah 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 it'd probably be worth tenner at least i would say i could be totally wrong herbal essences blue ginger yeah high street thing uh okay we have bedhead again not allowed to sell tiggies too many fakes i see we've got another clinique moisture surge you see it makes me wonder why do you get like stuff clinique stuff with that boxes um yeah i'm not sure about that i put it in there because i will have to investigate and i promise you i will do the video on fakes but we'll have to do this like one brand at a time because otherwise we'll be there forever we've got the userin anti-aging serum probably 8.99 uh maybe a little bit more we have another list list O, another one of the serums okay well look at this i really do not even have a box for shit yet because it doesn't look so much of it yet shishido full lash serum Ooh, shishido is really really good right and lash wear serum is worth quite a lot so i would love to think be 20 quid so we'll find out we have hey you how you ooh, ooh. <laughs> ooh. <laughs> i don't know what this is oh facial massage tool oh my god it just feels like a stone too have a look <laughs> it's like a spatula yeah here we are this is a face massage tool from china <laughs> seriously okay maybe i'm missing something i don't know but might as well take a kitchen spatula and rub it all over your face <laughs> what do i know really let's be fair i've only been doing this for like 12 years now oh okay we have a body brush or shoe brush any guesses home spa so yes it's a body brush i can see you can polish your suede shoes with that not polish but you know give them like a ruffle up oh uh, he's from london you know it's london all the london makes sometimes worth a bit so yeah don't know we'll see 
nice. I will have, oh yeah, we had one of those in a gift set, some Chinese pulsating face massager. Rubbish. We have our top R. Mm. Black face mask. This is black, but it's not black. It's got gold color. Yeah. Made in China, I don't know. Um, yeah. No, thank you. Crackle buff colors, oh my. Who would think of this, really, seriously? It's like insult on people that can't spell bath properly. Ridiculous. Oh, okay. We have Slim Me Bende. Oh yeah, bandages for a slimming things. Um, I heard of that before. I think we're looking about 25 quid. I uh, know, I think they're about 50 or 60 pounds for a set of four. Feels like we've got two in here. So yeah, that'd be half price. Unless we've got more. Seem to be no dates, but they can feel moist. All good. Oh, wrong box. Okay, we've got some more lollipop sticks. <coughs> we have space masks. Oh, it's got Liberty London shop sticker being ripped off. Uh, they are on eBay, five or each, and I think it should be about five inside them, so it's a good one. We have, what do we have? We have black walnut conditioner. Oh, um, yeah, that looks like a handmade stuff. I don't know. I don't like when people make their stuff in their back bedrooms. I don't trust it. I'm sorry, I don't trust it. Uh, I see we have oh, a lot of lip glosses or lipsticks, whatever they are. Some leaked. Uh, looks quite few. I think I saw them on eBay. I think they're about eleven pounds. Of course, it's caring and giving. It's vegan friendly. It's cruelty free and it's halal. I thought halal something to do with meat. Anyway, okay. Um, let's call them £10 each, that's good. We've got six so far. Don't know if we've got any more. We have red can. That'd be a tenner. I'm running out of space in my good box. It's good. We need some good luck. Oh yeah, look at that. Another four of those little glosses. Yeah, we need good luck. You know with this slot, like with all the stuff that we ever do, and if you guys ever contemplated buying like palettes and stuff, it's such a hit and miss. It's very difficult and sometimes really heartbreaking when you spend a lot of money and you don't really get a lot of money back or lose money. And it's always, always possible. As I said, for the years we've been doing this, it's literally, I almost want to say it's 50-50. Um, it's very rarely you make to make, get to make like loads of money on something that you buy for the amount of work that goes in. So, but yeah, anyway, such is life and such is the jobs we choose to do. Um, a root cover up. Never tried it, but it sounds like a great idea. I think they were initially 20 quid, probably, I don't know, maybe about 15 pounds at the moment. Uh, we have, what do we have? Body butter, sopa duper. <laughs> okay, it's a bit funky. Yeah, I don't know, um, I don't know, never heard of that, but it's probably be worth a tenner maybe, I don't know. I'll put this aside. We have some, a gift from Jennifer. Yeah. It okay, looks like a little sample, sealed. Don't know, I can see there's a couple there kicking around. I put them aside and I'll see what they're worth because I have no idea. Oh, okay. We have those Indian healing clay. It doesn't heal, it's just a clay. Um, expiry 1122, okay. Um, again, when they started, they used to be, I think they still retail about 25 pounds. On eBay, you're probably getting it about 8.99 because I think they do fake them. Although, there I say it, it's a mud mask. You can't really fake a mud mask. It's just made of mud anyway. So, anyway, who am I to judge? But yeah, uh, tenner. 8.99, 10 quid, whatever. So, uh, coconut curls. See, all the time I see something. It's always for curly hair. What about the rubbish hair like mine? No, all curlies. Oh, natural hair. Is that for curly hair? <laughs> no, natural and coloured hair. We had this brand before, as I said, all together by itself, sorry, it's very cheap. As a bundle, if I have enough, I'll do a bundle and it might be worthy. We have a Bioderma, that's probably be a 15, 15 quid for a little oil cleanser. Uh, Bath and body muslin facial cloth, that's non-branded, just China stuff. Okay, what do you have? L'Oreal True Match Foundation. Nice, sealed. Okay. Um, I think in the shops, if you do buy, it's probably like eight, ten quid on eBay. I'm not so sure. So again, they're probably going to be going as a bundle. 
I've got Kiehl's Ultra Facial Cream. Oh, again, I love Kiehl's, right? And on Amazon, if you've got stuff that's not scratched and perfect and boxed, it worth again more than double the amount of what you get for this on eBay unfortunately. This one, the lid is absolute trash, like it's been all over the floor somewhere. However, if it's sealed then it still brings us about £25, which is okay. Let's get this stuff out of it. Oh, we've got another one of those, a free gift from Jennifer. Where did I put it? There. Okay. Wow. Tropic. Ah, oh, okay. Just a nail file. Don't know what it's worth. We've got body conditioner, and is this out of date? Yeah, you by 14th of January 21. Oh, that's a bummer, but I'm gonna give it a sniff <laughs> and see if it's okay. I know it says it's fresh, but I normally like with meat and everything else, just go by smell and look rather than by the number. So, put that aside. Uh, some oh, hair oil. It's to be quite popular. Apparently people swear by this kind of stuff to make your hair grow. I've tried it and made my hair really greasy and they don't grow any faster or get any thicker. But that's just me. We have nail fungus treatment. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know. Put that here. Sometimes stuff like that's worth like tenner, but we have some. Oh my. Nail polish. WH Smith nail polish. Oh my god. Might as well be a pound shop special. This is atrocious, literally atrocious. Some people should stick with doing the magazines and books and stationery and not nail polishes, let's be fair. Skin Republic foot peel. I don't know. We tried the foot peels before. Some of them work really well. Just don't try to stand up in the shower after you had the sun because you can just fall black backwards on your bum and it will hurt. Speaking from experience. Oof. There's some weapons in here. No idea what this is. Well, it looks like tweezers for maybe nail art. I don't know. The wood looks really dodgy and it looks very dangerous. Yeah. No. We've got more masks. We have some facial sheet masks. Yeah, I don't know. Again, I'll make a bundle out of the masks all together. Oh, we have pry. Pry, sorry. Again, that's a QVC job. That's sealed. Um, it's only tiny, so that's probably worth a tenner. Sorry, I opened it. The nightmare with the, these things with the cosmetics, you have to sort of open up and feel for the seals and make sure the stuff is sealed because otherwise people are going to give you a lot of shit on eBay. So, okay, we've got another Elemis Pro Cleansing Balm. They're always good, they sell really fast. Again, there's only a teeny weeny one, so it'd be £15. Nonetheless, it's certainly a premium box, I'll tell you what. Um, considering and hopefully the half of the clarins are not uh, cliniques are not fake like one of them definitely then we are okay we have Josh Wood color some hair things okay I don't know 6.99 maybe a little bit more hair color some cost a lot of money we have okay funky soap the same as that thing here like a herb shampoo nettle shampoo I heard nettles do really good for your hair I just never bother going to dig them out to make shampoo or anything, but here we are. Orange and avocado shampoo. I might just try it, you know. Can't sell it, so I might as well try and use it. It might do wonders for my hair. Um, or lack of. Uh, gift, again. <laughs> oh, it's a bunch of tampons. I'm not, I'm not freaking kidding you. Oh, wonderful. Oh, my God. Okay. <laughs> In a cardboard box, like a really thick cardboard box, a bunch of tampons. Oh, I thought I've seen everything in the world, clearly not. Oh, oh nail stickers, I don't know, nail shield. Oh, whatever. Whatever. Okay, we have soap again. Eco Warrior soap, I think we had one before. You can join its friends there. <clears throat> We've got Erno Luz. I can pronounce that. One of those. Um, I think I've seen this one in a TK Max, and they're normally about 25 quid, so let's hope it's about 25 and 29 pounds if it's good. Can't see the date at the moment, but we'll have a look. Okay, what else do we have? Style Pro. Oh, a bloody reusable, like, pads, makeup remover pads. I haven't done anything with the other ones, so I don't even know the value, but it'd be worth something to someone anyway. Equal Warrior Soap, 
again we've got some more lashes always oh, are the first bunch of lashes yeah look at that like when i said to you might as well be like a sweeping brush like look at the size of that like seriously that's huge that is like half an inch at least it's madness I like lashes, fake eyelashes, but that's just crazy. But what do I know? Again. Um, put them in there. Uh, we have another gift. I'm saying that as like another gift, but because it's a mini sample, I have no idea what the full product size will be. If it's like 100 quid, then I might have like 20, 25 pounds on each little um, tube. I don't know. Um, Garnier face protection. I'll give that. Just in case we get summer this year. Oh, hold on a minute. We had summer, didn't we? We had a whole two weeks of sunshine. Damn it. Missed it. Never mind. There's always next year. We have some sanitizer, hand sanitizer. Well, the excitement went off. Another gift. That's a big one. Oh, Egyptian magic. Again, yeah. I think this one was faked quite a lot. I would take a guess, 15 quid at the moment still, hopefully. We've got some um, berry M, just like makeup y stuff. I'm scraping the bottom again right now. Micellar, Nivea Micellar. Again, I think they're very cheap. Like, if you buy them in the shop, they're not, but with the postage, blah, blah, blah. I don't think it's worth selling by itself. Oh, and we have a, uh, a plug. Wonderful. Thank you very much. Oh, like a magician. <laughs> I just pulled this out of the bag. Um, it's not your like, if it was an apple plug, I could be like, yeah, I could still sell it for like 20 quid. But no, great, not graded, model, laptop. <laughs> Wonderful. The, piece, the person with laptop would like to have that one, <laughs> I'm sure. <laughs> okay, sorry. Right, some more masks, little eye masks. Those guys are quite cool. Tried and tested, I must say. Right. Um, We've got a lot of bubble underneath again, so that means we're losing space for cosmetics and gaining space for air and bubbles. More masks. And, okay. Oh, some more of those lip glosses. Can't get there. A couple more of them. I hope they are worth like £10 at least, because I can just do like a multi list thing. Get those on there, provided I'm not getting bollocking for selling them. Uh, we have Struvectin, okay. It's a good brand, expensive brand. Again, you're not allowed to sell on Amazon like 99% of cosmetics anymore unless you're a super duper special person. And we're not one of them, not for all the products. Um, another Clinique mascara, I'm gonna open it and have a look. So far, it feels like it's okay, but I need to do more digging. We have some more heavens. Mm, wonderful. I might start wearing them. I'm getting so many of them, might as well. Every video you get to see me with a different headband. Okay. We have... What is those stickers? Oh, it's going to be throws again. Weird stickers. It must be a shop. Oh no, isn't it a wish shop? It could be a wish. I don't know. It's weird. See, I know a lot, but I don't know everything. You have some makeup again. Made in USA. It's worth investigating. Looks quite cute. I shove this up here. Well, that's it. Really, all we seem to have now is a lot of little stuff, like tiny. Okay, you go Gillette two-in-one facial scrub, mini Clinique, um, something tiny, tiny. Um, I've got some tiny Lossetane, like hotel specials. You can get this in the posh hotels. Um, people still love them if there's few of them. Got some more face masks. Oh, and another gift from, you forgetting the name, Jennifer. Uh, thank you, Jennifer. <laughs> uh, I'm kidding. Right, so, Neutrogena. Hmm. Hand mask. So, yeah, Jeanette's there. So, right then, boys and girls. Um, I have on the bottom, that's a soap bar again. I think all I just have. Oh wow. <laughs> Is it a special note? No, it's not a note. It's like, what on earth? What is that? Why? Why is it here like that? Oh, 
oh, another lip gloss and more lashes and pretty much this is it oh no another one of those special special oh that's a conditioner to go with the shampoo earlier as i said i wasn't sure i think probably 10 or 15 quid but to be fair apart from a lot of masks and a couple of occasional stuff and face masks and lollipops <laughs> sticks um i just have lashes left and gillette stuff left and just occasional bit of crap so um well i think i'll be concluding that one <laughs> Steve will run. Oh my god. If this is not a piss take off, uh, if Seth Laurent, I don't know what it is, but it, his name is Steve. <laughs> oh god. And of course, the super duper quality. Oh, makes you laugh some stuff that people come up with. They, think, they must think you're stupid, right? Because you're going to see this on the set for like two ninety nine. and think, oh my god, is there something wrong? Is there something wrong? No. Oh god, that's funny. Make me laugh. I've got the. Oh, some shaver blades. And yeah, and basically, 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 just mini stuff. Hold on, I'll just get a handful just to give you an idea what's left. Ah, that's it. We've got Victoria's Secret, Secret Lip Gloss that's been well, taped for not opening. Mascara, a uh, a brush. Oh, I just I shouldn't have done that. Um, Four ninety nine. Lipstick, another Victoria's Secret, another Victoria's Secret, and another Victoria's Secret. There's Victoria's Secret thrown up in here. This is fine because Victoria's Secret stuff is great. And I think they're about nine quid, so providing they are okay. Just the, just the tape really just worries me. Why would you tape it up, to be fair? But I don't know. I'll have a look. I'll put them aside. So, yeah, I'll stop rambling. So, basically, this will summarise the box number four. I think... This box is far the best box, but I think this is the premium box that we paid a little bit of premium. So I'm just going to go upstairs, list all the stuff, and obviously check out the cleaning stuff and make sure everything is okay, and then get it all listed. And then I'll have to be coming back and do a box number five and six at some point. It feels like deja vu all the time. But anyway, thank you for sticking with me. I am trying to do this as quick as I can, but still give you some information and entertainment. So hopefully you do appreciate it. Don't forget to thumbs up to like the video, subscribe, and we'll see you again very soon. Thank you very much.